This morning, a major effort is underway to put four derailed freight cars back on the tracks along Harbor Drive near Cesar Chavez Parkway in Barrio Logan. Yeah, this is a story our breaking news tracker was on during 10 News at 11 last night. 10 News reporter Ashley DiMartino is there live right now. So, Ashley, crews are making progress, but they still have a long way to go. Yeah, slowly but surely, Virginia and Bill with this. You know, the two train cars that we had actually shown you for the past 60 minutes here on 10 News, they've been cleared at this point. So crews will actually begin to work on this one right here. And you can see it's it's more severely damaged than the other ones that we had been showing you this morning. The wheels of it just completely snapped off. Now take a look at some video we have of crews that were working overnight. They began working on this at about 3 a.m. this morning using their bulldozers, cranes, and what's called a side boom. They're able to clear out all of the debris, get the wheels back on the train cars so that they can right and then be able to really move them out of the way or clear them from the tracks. The BNSF uh, has estimated that they're hoping to have all four of these freight train cars off of the tracks uh, a little later on this morning and they are hoping that they will have this line up and running by noon today. Now, of course, Harbor Police and BNSF investigators are going to be working together looking into the cause of this. Now, I should let you know that this morning no commuter lines are affected by this. So the trolley that comes down here to Barrio Logan not affected, uh, nor is any of the coaster lines affected by this. We're live this morning. Ashley DiMartino, 10 News. Yeah, I'm glad